And our next performer, I'm going to report music to the other Okay. So our next performer is going to be Nia, who's going to um, announce her name and her piece as well. Go ahead. Hi, my name is Nia, and I'm going to be playing Faded Dreams by Martha Muir. And that was Nia playing um, Fate of Dreams by Mar Martha Muir. Um, all right, so um, I'm going to start the poll again, and then we can go from there. So you guys can start pulling off that poll. And then if you have any verbal feedback, um, you can just raise your hand. Pretty much. Does that make sense to start pulling off that poll? What results are coming in? Does anyone have any verbal feedback that they would like to give? No one so far. Okay. Um, let me see. Uh, how about Shivani? Do you have anything? Any feedback to give? We're not. <laughs> All right. Um. Yes, do you have any? Since you guys are both audience members. Do you have any feedback to give? Uh, not, not much. I guess the, the dynamics were pretty good. Uh, that's pretty much what I have. Okay. And uh, Matt, can you go ahead. Um, I thought that the dynamics were okay for the most part, but then there's some parts that they said forte, but then you play like piano and stuff. And I think you could work on some phrasing. Right. Yeah, definitely. Okay, so um, I'm gonna go with the poll results now, and then we can go from there. All right. So taking a look at the poll, um, in terms of your dynamics, um, you got two votes for three, one vote for four, one vote for five. Um, I thought the dynamics were nice in terms of the character. Um, but yeah, I think I do agree with the, um, the two votes for three kind of leaning between like three, four, five, kind of around a low four. 
um, probably because there were other dynamics in the piece and it kind of felt that you went for a very soft dynamic, but you didn't really um, go for a very large dynamic range in terms of the expression of the piece. Um, in terms of articulation, um, you got one vote for three and four votes or three votes for four. Um, so it's about between a three and a four, leaning towards a four. And I thought the articulation was pretty good. Um, the rhythm was on point. Um, I didn't hear too many issues with that. So um, yeah. And then in terms of balance, um, you got one vote for three and three votes for four. Um, yeah, your balance was pretty all right. Um, I didn't hear too many issues with that. Um, so yeah, I think the main thing that um, would be to focus on is some of maybe, I think the left hand um, was a little bit soft at some points, but beyond that, I thought the balance wasn't too bad or too off. Um, phrasing, you got three votes for three, one vote for four. And in terms of the phrasing, um, I think that would be the biggest thing to kind of work on. Um, I think between some of the um, lines and some of the notes, um, especially with the little embellishments, all that stuff, um, I think that'd be really, really um, good to kind of work on how you want to phrase those um, sections, especially. And then beyond that, movement, you got one vote for two and um, two votes for four and one vote for five. So it's a little all over the place. Um, I'd say the movement wasn't bad. Um, I think you can definitely add a little bit more since I think this is a very expressive piece. But um, I think in terms of that, um, it kind of goes along with kind of working with everything else, kind of the phrasing, all that stuff as well. Right. 